Hello everyone, this is Coolad4 and um we're gonna show you how to make a character in bitstrips. So we're gonna go bitstrips.com slash landing Whoops, looks like I spelled it wrong. Ending you click this, not that. Um we just basically once you get your in your account, you click create create character, and then let it load for a bit. Now we got your character builder. You can actually this is the basics. You get your gender, color, what it looks like, like if it's gonna be fat, tough, whatever, t height. Head, sh head shape, jaw shape, um, hair color, nose, eyes, and eyebrows, mouth, clothing, and your description. But I don't want to go with this because it's not the best way I usually make my characters by going to advanced builder. Fine tune your designs with more other and options. So you click that. You get your body and everything. I'm gonna start with a male body. You're gonna make it tall. I don't like. To, I like my characters tall. You want? I want it a bit buff. Maybe a little bit taller. Now, average choice is fine. Okay. Now, <laughs> I'm gonna pick a shirt. It can be either this or any of this. I rather go with this. Um, I'm gonna go with the custom color because I like custom colors. They are awesome. Now, I'm gonna see, pick a color of my pants, maybe. Yeah, yeah that doesn't go go with it unless you have a belt. Yeah, that's better. Um, let's put give this dude a little pants and sh socks and shoes. I want to make this black. There you go. No gloves for today. Hats. Hats. Mm. Yeah. Uh, sweater? No. Jacket? Suits? No. Scarf? Yes, because I love scarves. Um, backpack? Nah. Okay, let's work on the head now. What I want is you can pick your cranium or head shape. And I picked this head chip. Now we're gonna work on its jaws. I want this to look. And here we go. Now I want to work on his eyebrows. Let's see, I like the thin eyebrows because I think it looks normal. Now let's see. You can pick your eye shape. I like to use this eye shape. And then once you get your eye shape, eye shape, you can get your pupils. And I like to use this pupil because it's. I don't know, I just find it awesome. Now, just set the color, just fiddle around. Okay, now once you got that done, we can go on the eyelashes. If you want to add eyelashes or any eye detail, whatever, you can. I'm not gonna do it because I don't usually use it. Now, we're just gonna pick nose shape. We can pick these, any types of noses. We can make like this. It's all. Freaky in their own special way. Um, yeah. You got your Rudolph nose, your dog nose, no nose, and, you know, your basic stuff for awesomeness. Okay, now, I like to use the thin nose because I think it looks awesome. Now, we're going to pick a mouth shape. It can do this, this, whatever. Um, lips, whatever. No mouth, whatever. I like to keep it normal. Oh, now, we're going to pick an ear shape. Um... I think that's good. Yeah. Now we can put. You can either choose earrings or any other earrings design, and cheeks or chins. Okay, I'll take this one. Maybe. No, I'm not gonna go with chins today. She beards and goatees. Okay. No mustaches today. Um. You can do and cheek details. You can do and forehead details. You can either do this, um, this, whatever. I like it blank because it 
this looks much more better. Um, more cheek details and everything. And I already got the hat. Ooh, I forgot the hair. Okay, now let's remove the hat for now. Okay, what's going on with the hair? We got all these hair designs to boy. If you choose male, it goes boy to girl. If you choose female, it goes girl to boy. Okay, so I'm gonna choose um this hairstyle and go with this. And I'm gonna raise the eyes a bit and put back his hat. And make you can either do your designs and everything. Hmm. Let's see. Uh, is this bad? Wait, blue. Blue is awesome. Just make it lighter a bit. And thick. Okay, now we can't not do this. Huh? Okay, we're just gonna copy this code. Go to the hat. Change its color. And then paste, and there. There you go. Now you got your basic person now. Now what you want to go to do is name it. I'm gonna name him. Well, you don't have to name him specifically because the name's not gonna appear in the comic. So I'm gonna name him exclamation points and click save. Once you're done, this page will show up of your character's profile. You don't have to do it, but if you want, you can. I'm gonna set its permissions to friends full, because I like my friends to use my characters. Save it, and then you're basically done when you got your character and everything. And this is Code 4 showing you how to make a character in 2010 through whatever years you're watching this video right now. Okay, see you later, guys.